Where the hell is it? Oh, there it is. See, for those that don't believe me, I do have friends. That's Daniel. Hi, Daniel. What's up? Those are targets. Hi, targets. I guess when you run out of targets, you can use the tag off your pants. So there's the targets. That's where we're shooting from. Mr. Daniel's going first with his Browning 9mm. I might be in trouble. Clear. Go okay. Let's go see what you did. That's a long shot. Yeah. Not quite that good yet. Yeah, three out of five. So take a really good look at this one because I want you to really, really, really realize it's going to look exactly like that when I'm done shooting. <laughs> and we are both shooting nine mil. I'm shooting out of my Rock Island. He was shooting out of a Browning. So a much, much nicer gun. Oh my God. Hey, I hit it. We did it. We did it. Yay. Two. Yay. I win. You win. I win. So, yeah. That's the fun of target shooting. Of course, he gets reception out here, so he also gets <laughs> texts while he's shooting. From he can mul he can multitask. From my mom. Yeah. Better be safe. Okay, so a little bit more reasonable distance. This is like if you're at the Arby's drive-thru and the dude's spitting on your fries and you need to, like, teach him a lesson. <laughs> so, what is that? Ten yards? Seven yards? Something like that. No, ten. It's, it's about 25 feet. It's that many. It's about 25 feet. Yeah, if somebody uh, can do like um, maths, figure that out for me. So, because they don't mark it, but this place is freaking awesome, by the way. If you guys have never been out here, you should come out here. I'm not telling you where it is because I don't want anybody out here. Anyways, whenever you're ready, Mr. D. So that was 20 rounds from that many feet. That's bad. Yeah, you're normally a little bit tighter than that. Is it because I was filming you? All right, well, now it's Mr. Joe's time. Love the smell of gunpowder in the morning. Surprisingly, it doesn't smell like I'd expect it to. I'll point out that I have one shoelace undone. <laughs> so when I miss, that's why. I also have 17 in each mag. I'm more of a vertical shooter. <laughs> it's dead, I think. Yeah, I think I got him. Got him. A lot of them touched, which I yeah. like. Of course, well, I started got, going fast. You got more red than I did. Yeah, so. but I also fired 35% more rounds than you. Yeah, but still. Percentage-wise, I only got three. Yeah. So. Three out of 20, and I got... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yep, twelve. Twelve out of thirty-four. Well, well that fine. guy's dead because I mean, you look at the size. Yeah. If I was shooting at me, I'd have got me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, I'm happy. Good job. That. Daniel's the guy that introduced me to shooting, so you know, you can blame him. <laughs> when all my videos are all about guns from now on, guns and video games. That's all it's ever going to be from now on. If you got a problem with that, call your congressman. Or my mom. Or your mom. I saw her last night. She's hot. And uh, just for edification, this gun sucks. Effing sucks. This is a Thunderbolt that is the Golden Bullet. They are exactly the same. They all have the exact same feeding issue, right? Yes. They would not feed up into the chamber. And the mag tried to pull down as soon as the slide comes forward. And unless you have like a 900-pound spring, it's not going to be fast enough. So, Although I did find a good use for this 22 ammo that I can't use. That's more reliable than that stupid ass gun. By the way, best way to carry your weapon, guys. Yeah, no, it's not. You don't need a holster. Yes, you do. Just stick it in your pocket. Don't listen to him. You should put a mag in it too before you do it. Yeah, no. And cock it. Better yeah, you should just carry it right in the front of your pants, fully yeah. loaded and ready to go. 
Use your penis as a muzzle stop. <laughs> that way you can, you know, know exactly uh, where the barrel is at all Yeah, time. if you never want to have kids, maybe. Uh, you know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm just doing the math. It's 12 cents for a bullet. A vasectomy is like $10,000, so it, it could work. Here we you know, go. put this in a pocket that's easier to grab. Should have brought my pack timer. Huh? My timer yeah. times Does your shots. Does it do weeks? What? Does it do weeks? All right, ready? Let's go. Going hot. I don't think there was 17 in that one. Well, uh, I don't see 33 bullet holes, so no, there's three of them right here. Yeah, well, you know, I was aiming for the bird, I was aiming for the bird. <laughs> I just wanted to see, I've never done that before because I'm a noob. Okay, it's enough. a lot of fun shooting as fast as you can. Yeah, I won't do that again, but you know, as you can see, he got way better when I turned off the camera. <laughs> We moved up like two feet too, but yeah, yeah. He put three more mags through and cut it. All of these are three mags, so you know, if you're gonna piss him off, film him. He won't hit you. <laughs> That's probably true. Yeah, yeah. Last so. weekend when me, him, and his father came out here, or last week, he was hitting one-handed from that second line right into a wolf's head. But uh, yeah. Well, yeah, but today I can't do nothing. It's called the yips. For our next attempt, we're going to play some 9mm horse. You can't see it. I actually, let me see, can I zoom in? Yeah, I doubt I can go in far enough though. You can maybe make it out. There's a silver dot. Wow, that's shaky. Nah, yeah, you can. See that little silver speck? We're gonna try to shoot that from um, here. I have no, I don't know how far this is. I'd have to measure it. Uh, it's all the distances. Hey, nerd that figured out the first measurement, figure that one out for us, would you? Nope. This is the best part about trying to film something like this, is going to be all the jump cuts and edits that we do. That's why we need two cameras, one downrange. Yeah, if somebody hadn't lost the battery to his actual camera. I didn't even hit the target, dude. Well, luckily, that quarter is still safe. Well, you might have hit in here. I, I, may, I mean, he was aiming for the bullseye again, guys. <laughs> wow, that is a that is a long distance target. That's a long shot. And I will point out to the viewers at home, all of his shots have been low. So the fact that he put it up high, he kind of jinxed himself. Hitting a quarter we can't see from too far away with handguns. All right. This always works in the movies. <laughs> this one's for you. It's nice out at this range by ourselves. We can have a little fun. Hell yeah. Safety yeah. first, but still have fun. It looks like the quarter is uh, un unmaimed. No, now we're going to move we're, up to Now we're feet. not even hitting the target. We're, we're going to stand right here. Yeah, we're going to stand at that line. It's about 10 feet. Yeah, and see if anybody can hit it. <laughs> see if we can get this thing. You should uh, always keep your slide locked, I've been told, and pointed down away and not near anybody that you like. Or even your enemies. You don't want them to know it's coming. What are we doing? White uh, line? Yeah, we'll do white line since we both have extra mag. And then uh, if somebody hits it, great. If not, then we'll move up. Damn. Nailed it. Let's go see what he did to it. Uh, it looks like I just hit the top. Yeah, he rim fired it. So it's good so. for another run. So now I get a chance to duplicate the feet. He that did it. way off. Yeah. Um, I don't he, know what I did there. He John F. Kennedy the first shot down into the left. Uh, uh, uh. And the second shot was spot on. So he was okay. the, the second shot, he was the second gunman on the grassy knoll. <laughs> and I have one glove on. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Wait, there's no mag in it. It helps if you load the gun. I'm a professional gunman thingy. Remember, load the gun. They're in here. I swear to God. I'm a I, think, I think someone's playing pocket pool. Yeah, All right. I was in the other pocket. I was just being happy. Going hot. Going hot. Two shots. Where the hell is it? Oh, there it is. That kid's is cold. I didn't feed it all the way in. You didn't rack the slide after you put it in? I didn't rack it enough. I just press checked it. Oh. 
Why is it moving so much? Your arm's not locked. There you go. It's a little high. Why is your 9 mil hole bigger than mine? Wait. Did I get it? I yep. I got it. You got it. Two shots. Woo! Wait. I have no idea where the quarter went, though. It's right here. I think I hit it in the exact same spot. Yep. 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 Cool. Two rivets. Yeah. Pretty cool. Nice. Pretty cool. Hey, look at our grouping. We make one. Yeah. Group. Nice. What was that? You? Your yeah. First? That was me because that so was you were you high. The, yeah. You hit the quarter. I was low, low on my start, and that's where I hit the quarter. So not bad though. Not yeah. bad. Good job, man. Yay! All right. So we both hit it on our second shot but neither one of us hit it flush. So he's gonna take a few shots, see if he can hit it flush, and it's his new souvenir. Ooh. Wow, that, that hit it pretty damn hard that time. <laughs> um, oh, Dude, where, I have no idea where the quarter went. Oh, uh, the hole, it might have pushed it through, dude. Back after these messages. Yeah, we'll be back, kids. Oh, look, there it is. No, I'm just kidding, that's a washer. Yeah, we're still looking for the quarter. If we find it, we'll let you know. Yeah. It's not looking likely though. Nope. Oh well, bummer. So, guess what kids? We found it. The third board is where it was set up. And we were just walking over here and I was looking at that wad. And I looked down and there's the quarter. That's a nice tear through too. That's a nice shot. <laughs> yeah, so it tore through it and it had to have pushed it right through. So that's cool. There's your souvenir. Awesome. Didn't think we were gonna find that. Okay, last challenge of handguns is going to be 10 rounds, nine mil at the full people body. targets. The full body. The full body targets. We're gonna do five and five, five head, five body. Whoa. From the shortest line. Whoa. So it will be like a normal encounter on the street. You know, the guy comes up asking you for the time and you just don't feel like dealing with them. So you pull out your handgun and start shooting them. The wind was literally holding that up. Yeah, I know. I didn't want to say it. So yeah, so we're going to run 10 rounds. We've been using Tula ammo this whole time. So we've been using the exact same rounds. And uh, he's going to run 10 in his Browning. I'm going to run 10 in my Rock Island. And uh, we'll just see what happens. Then we're going to move on to burping contest. Then we're going to move on to rifle. He's taking a really long time to pee. Little bit of a change to our plans. We are going to fire 13 rounds. Six at this bullseye, six at this bullsh guy, and one at this target. We both have a target up, and these are the ones we're gonna take with us. And we are firing from here. Nerds, go at it again. Tell us how far that is. 20 feet. We're, we're, we're a mile and a half out. So, Same spot we were shooting the quarter from the last time. Yeah, we were, from where we were able to hit the quarter, so we should be able to shoot this. Anyways, on your own time, sir. Are we doing this for speed or just... No, accuracy. Somebody miscounted. Did I? Did you put one in the little guy? Nope. I put two too many in the main chest. Ah, well, that's fine. I started shooting, and then I was like, oh, shit, that was only supposed to be six. <laughs> I think I'm in trouble, though, kids. And then I started counting, and I was like, I don't know where I'm at now. All right, well, I'll match your shots. So, so I only did four up here. So four there, nine down there. Damn, I'm screwed. So nine rounds to the body, four to the head. If that guy isn't dead... I don't know what else, and another word that rhymes with dead. <laughs> Question is, did he remember the mag? Yes, he did. All right, here we go. Okay, my turn. I'm gonna step back. He won, but at least I killed the guy. 
the now uh, not too bad. Your head grouping is way better than mine. This I'm now nicknaming the Kennedy shot. Every mag, you've had one round go low into the left. That's because I pull one. Yeah. That means but, I pull one. Probably my last shot. Yeah. That's me, you know, my, my last. First. I'm pretty oh, sure these were my last two. That wasn't my first. So. I know that wasn't my first. No. My first was like here. Yeah, your first few were like killing the X. But I think we both could safely assume we could actually stand near each other in a gunfight and not kill each other. Yeah. So. Yay! Rifle. I'm gonna have to stop this video here because it is going way too damn long. I looked at it when I had the rifle footage, and as you can see, I'm still finishing. But when I had the rifle footage included, it was over 40 minutes long. And I haven't done a video that long in quite a while. In fact, it was an earlier pickup video, which would be up here, that little card. Click on the, um, what is it, an exclamation point, whatever it is. Click on that and it'll thank you to it. I haven't done one of these in a long time. Yeah. Thank you to Daniel. He's my good friend. I've known him for years. And his father and him are opening a gun store. So I'm going to help him make videos for his channel as well as continue making videos for this channel. And I'll also be able to work for him to part time. And that's cool because it'll allow me to supplement my income without going over the amount that I'm allowed to make on disability, as well as get a discount and earn firearms. And firearms are like gold and silver. If you have the right ones, they never go down in value. Some guns do go down in value. <laughs> Kiapa or <laughs> High Point, but good stuff, Brownings, Kimbers, Ed Browns, you know, whatever, they always keep their value, so that's what I'm going to start collecting is probably handguns. Yeah, so look for part two, that'll be coming in a day or two, um, otherwise just keep on coming along, subscribe down there, you know where it is, it's right about there. Maybe over there. Or, uh, hi there, arm. Click on the uh, smiley face in the corner and check out a couple of other videos, including the first gun video, which was just me out shooting a really bad gun, <coughs> Kiapa. And it may just have been a bad build. Who knows? I don't know. And, uh, yeah, if you want to become a Patreon, that'd be really cool. goes towards computer equipment and ammo now, so... Yeah, and as always, I'll talk to you later.